encountered that your novel was being published. Ah, thank you, Pilgrim. Yes, it seems to be so. And therefore, my retirement from teaching looms. What? Oh. I made a promise to myself many years ago that if my novel were published, I would retire to write another one. And if it were not published, it was to be destroyed upon my death. <laughs> between her, her now husband and then son. Even when these new facts come to light, she continues to deny them to herself and to Oedipus as well because of her shame. It is her denial of the truth that leads to her demise. Well, <laughs> still waters do run deep. <laughs> this denial of truth, does it not lead to all soul sickness, and it must be purged. Okay, well then, we agree. Jocasta did know his real identity, but loved him anyways, as a son and a husband. <laughs> Whoa. If Jocasta really loved Oedipus, she never would have fucked him. You don't fuck your kid. No, because you just fuck random strangers. You meet at parties, don't you? Oh, oh, oh. Oh.
party at Go-Go's tonight. What? Oh, we'd like in the street just to barely pay you this. 